Now, we will discuss about multiple sclerosis. Multiple sclerosis Multiple sclerosis MS is a long-lasting chronic disease of the central nervous system. It is thought to be an autoimmune disorder, a condition in which the body attacks itself by mistake. MS is an unpredictable disease that affects people differently. Some people with MS may have only mild symptoms. Symptoms Fatigue Clumsiness Dizziness Difficulty with bladder regulation Loss of balance and coordination Difficulty with cognitive function thinking, memory, concentration, learning, and judgment Mood changes Causes Multiple sclerosis is caused by your immune system mistakenly attacking the brain and nerves. It's not clear why this happens, but it may be a combination of genetic and environmental factors. Complications Difficulty walking without assistance Loss of bowel or bladder control Memory loss Sexual dysfunction Depression and anxiety Diagnosis and tests Blood tests and urine tests A magnetic resonance imaging test Dot dot an optical coherence tomography OCD test A lumbar puncture Evoked potential EP test Multiple sclerosis treatment There is no cure for MS but there are treatments that can reduce the number and severity of relapses and delay the long-term disability progression of the disease. Corticosteroids, such as intravenous infused into a vein methylprednisolone, are prescribed over the course of three to five days. Prevention Eating nutritious meals Getting enough sleep Participating in physical activities regularly Not using tobacco products Ampera tablet Ampera Dalfampridine Extended Release Tablets 10 mg is the first and only brand prescription medicine indicated to help improve walking in adults with multiple sclerosis MS. This was demonstrated by an increase in walking speed. Side Effects Trouble sleeping insomnia, dizziness, nausea, and headache may occur. If any of these effects last or get worse, tell your doctor or pharmacist promptly. Read the medication guide provided by your doctor before you start using mifepristone. Keep the guide to reread if needed. Read and sign the patient agreement form provided by your doctor. If you have any questions, consult your doctor or pharmacist. Thank you for watching my video. Please subscribe my channel.